Here we have a 2008 on an 08 registration Volvo B12M Yonkia JHV 53 seat executive coach. We are in North Wales this morning at Clinogan Trevor Motor Company down just south of Carnarvon. A company that's been around for a lot, a lot of years in the village. And we're looking at this X parts of Hamilton Volvo Yonk. Now, I'm not going to lie, it isn't mint. Okay, it's got quite a lot of battle scars, more near side than off side. But we'll work through it as we go around. What you need to know is that this is being sold as it is, not with all what you see being repaired. And the price will. Um, the price will reflect that. We've got a centre continental door. Offside's not so bad, to be honest. Uh, until we get to this corner. One of the best attributes for me of a B12M is the luggage space because you've still got a massive boot and you've got a big side locker down the front now as we come round down the near side the story changes because there's a bit on the back corner there but then as we work our way down here we've got skirt damage there 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 stretch panel's got that there there's a little bit of corrosion up at the top uh, it's not raining in by the way so just a little bit of corrosion getting to the luggage you've also got this massive through uh, side locker these were originally built or the predecessor was a B B10M SE where they moved the engine basically from immediately behind um, the front axle to the middle to give that extra luggage that was they were built up mainly on uh, Plaxton Paragons don't think there are any premiers uh, for National Express work and the B12M developed out of that uh, and obviously the B12B which became the standard offering the doors got all that sort of mess on it the front corner and all this is it, this is working in the lanes of North Wales nothing more nothing less but when you start adding it up it really needs you know the front doing because I think there's a bit I might be wrong yeah there's a bit on this side as well so it needs a front paint it needs pretty much certainly all the bottom half but you might as well do the stretch panel because you've got that so it needs it needs and the back corner it needs probably about 60 percent of it painting you might as well just paint the lot because by the time i might be teaching people how to suck eggs here but um when you're painting a vehicle it's the prep work that takes the time and the money not the paint job so when you're prepping a full vehicle to paint is quite easy well it's not easy but you're really covering the glass up aren't you where when you're prepping um, bits and bobs it's more involved so by the time you've done the bits and bobs you might as well repaint the coach you know that's my view but as I said we'll reflect that in the price we've got 53 fans of gala reclining seats they're fitted with three point seat belts centre armrest these have also been re-trimmed at some point because being ex parts of Hamilton it would have had a black interior but the red works with the gold so that's all good also this maquette it's a um, 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 um. <laughs> my mind's gone blank Sigma it's a Sigma maquette and uh, current so very easy to get maquette if, if there's any repairs required etc We've got a centre sunken toilet unit 
with um, hot drinks facility. We're wired for CCT. We're also CCTV. We're also wired for DVD with two fixed monitors, fully air conditioned. Uh, Therma King system on this vehicle. The winner with it is, you know, it's got 11 months MOT. So we know, or we'd like to think, with the MOT, mechanically, it should be sound. So all you've got to do, really, to tidy this up is throw a lick of paint at it. Um, the only other thing to point out, really, is the, um, the sunroof window, which is cracked top to bottom so there's probably that to replace as well if you want to do it so but as I said it's being sold as it is but the price will reflect what needs doing to it okay so dash is all in good order it's up there on the miles it's 850,000 kilometers but it's 15 year old so it's actually not so bad because that's what 50,000 kilometers a year give or take which doesn't equate to massive high mileage no buttons missing everything where they sub should be displays are working correctly we've got a fridge in the dashboard courier seat but you know if you're looking for something just you know for round the doors schools local private hire etc you know you won't do anything any wrong with a Volvo or young Kia as I said it just needs um, tidying up a bit coat of paint on this will be a million dollars so to recap it's a 2008 on an 08 Volvo B12M Yonkia JHV 53 seat executive coach